good morning everybody it's Casey the Rockstar Flipper back with you on Tuesday and it is a normal day the holiday is over we are back to work and as promised it is Goodwill Outlet Ben Day in Orlando which is about an hour and 10 minutes for me an hour to an hour and 10 minutes I don't usually come this far but I uh, wanted to hit this store um, today I haven't been over here in a little while and I wanted to get the most out of today so we're gonna spend like three hours over here and hopefully we'll come up with some good stuff. Uh, maybe there will be some um, viewers or some YouTube or Instagram or social media viewers here and we'll be able to hook up with them, get them on video if they are. Uh, I know there's one over here at least. Um, so if you're not um, from the Orlando area, you'll be able to check this bin out on video. But if you are, hopefully I get to see you today. So we're about to pull in and uh, I can film inside of this bin. So they don't really have a problem with me filming, not as of yet. If they do, yeah, whatever, but we'll get the video. So see you guys in a minute inside. All right, so we are here. This is Orlando location, Goodwill Outlet, Ben store. Let's give you guys an idea of the back and parked way out back there. So I should be able to get like two hours in here. And uh, yeah, let's go see what we can find in here. All right guys, so we're inside of the uh, Goodwill Outlet Bin, Orlando, all this stuff. And uh, so far it's it's been all right. Um, one of my uh, secret items, these España shirts, these Jersey shirts, they're from Spain, they're called Espanas. It's Spanish for Spain, of course, and they sell super good. Um, Adidas is kind of doing good right now. I've got an Adidas women's track suit, warm up jacket, pretty good. Um, got quite a few pair of swimming trunks, O'Neal, Oki, Billabong. Summer's coming up, I told you guys, stock up on them. Some cute American Eagle jeans that are double zero or regular zero. Um, usually I don't have a problem selling those. We live in Florida, so this is a bikini, again, swimwear. It's Miami Heat for a girl that's a Heat fan. A couple of neckties. Um, This little girl's glitter, it's like a sparkle, as you guys can see that sparkle glitter dress. So we're just getting started. Got a, um, got a Batman outfit as well, so. We're gonna keep, keep picking though and see what else we can find. We're just getting rolling in here, but uh, you guys can see how crazy big this place is. So it's really, really big. All right, so we just picked up this cool 70s costume disco looking thing. We'll sell that. Picked up a fire truck, little Dalmatian scrub. It's pretty cool. And then one of my favorite items of today. It's not expensive, but this will help pad it because this is like an instant set. This is my little pony, Rainbow Dash. Dress, pretty cool. And everybody over there is lining up. Everybody over there over there is lining up for another rotation so we're going to give it one more rotation and hopefully we can get some really good stuff and take Nicole out. I'm going to beat you Nicole. So they'll roll out those ones way over at the far wall over there all new no one's shop no one's supposed to be shopping over there I think. We'll go check those out. But here's our entire bin let me show you guys. It's really big. Those are the hard goods. That's all the hard goods we have, just that. And then those are books over that gentleman's head. Yeah. All right, so I'm having a pretty crabby day because I guess I'm cursed at these bins. The Batman outfit for a little boy, that's pretty cool. I did find a Columbia shoe, and if I don't find the other one, I'm buying this, and I'm selling it to somebody that's an amputee because they do sell. I've sold quite a few items. But um, since I'm having a pretty bad day, I'm just going to steal somebody else's haul. And this is one of my viewers. And she's having a much better day than me. And I'll show you, yeah. She got, these are new with tags too. They still have the original NFL tags on them. Look at that, Oakland Raiders, they're jeans, they're cool. And if you don't know, Oakland, uh, the Raiders just got the approval contract to move to Las Vegas next year. So they're not playing um, in Oakland anymore. So any of this kind of stuff is, uh, is gonna become, I would assume more valuable with them leaving Oakland. And these are actually women's, which is funny. They're cheerleader boot. And I looked them up. She's gonna do pretty good on these, probably 35, 40 bucks. 
Yep, somebody else taking video games. Look, people learn from me. See this? It's like an $18 game. I sell it all the time for PlayStation. A couple other things. Where's those Tommy Bahamas? Oh, oh, they are. Tommy Bahama board shorts with summer coming up. Oh, these are swim trunks. They have the lining. Swim trunks. They're still good. Anything um, summer board shorts, swim trunks, stock up on. I bought. I have four pair in the in the cart right now of uh, of swim trunks because they will start selling right around the end of February. I sell all of them. And then she got the one other thing that's awesome. They're kind of a bigger uh, size, not too big, but if you don't recognize the tag, they're Aria. These jeans are expensive retail. They're over 100, I'm pretty sure. Close to it. I'll show you guys. I'm destroying her thing. But these are probably $30, $40 as well. I didn't look these ones up, but, and I don't think you've been here, what, maybe like 25, 30 minutes? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. This is probably easily gross sale, 120 maybe, 110, 120. Net maybe like 75, and this is gonna cost her like 10 bucks. 10 bucks tops. 10 bucks tops, so. I'm all right with that. Pretty good haul. This is her second trip in here today, by the way. Do you wanna be here? Yeah. Here she is. I, I gotta Hi. ask people if they wanna be on video. This is Christina. Hi. And uh, she's out here in Orlando. She lives closer than me. It takes me an hour and 10 minutes, of course, so. Takes me 20. Takes her 20, lucky her. Um, but I haven't had luck today, so I'm gonna have to come back later this week, probably Thursday or Friday. I'm gonna be back again. But uh, look at that, just the top of the car, just just this, 10 bucks, probably $100 in sales, maybe 60, 70 in profit after fees. Better than my sad little cart over there. <laughs> look, I probably don't even have that much, and I've already filled up like half of it, except the boot, which if I can find the other boot, which I'm gonna take another look, these boots would be like 60, 70 bucks, but maybe I can get 25 out of an individual one. The only cool thing that I did pick up that I'm taking a chance on, look at these little like uh, three quarter, I don't even know what these things are, but somebody will like them. Anyways, I'm gonna keep looking. I'm gonna try to make better this trip. I got another hour I can get stuff. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it gets a little better. All right, so we're out of the Goodwill. I just packed everything up in the car. Bye Goodwill. See you next time, maybe later this week. Had a good time, bought a lot of stuff. I only spent like $23, so Nicole's got a $2 jump on me if she spends 25. But we'll see what I got when I get home. We'll do the haul video, we'll post that up for you guys, and then we'll have to wait and see what Nicole was able to score at her haul. I believe that she is not able to go to the bins today because her son's school is off due to inclement weather and she has to keep an eye on him. So she may do her haul video tomorrow, but I'm gonna go ahead and put mine up. And then when she puts hers up, I'll link her video down below this video and she'll do the same for mine. So you guys can compare the two hauls, you guys can watch it and we can get some estimates from people who they think won and what they think we'll sell it for. Um, it's just a friendly competition. We're not really doing it for anything. Nobody's gonna win anything, but a lot of bragging rights. Um, but anyways, I can't wait to see Nicole's video and see what she does. And uh, can't wait to see how this turns out, see how my haul does. And uh, when I get home, I'll get it all ready for you guys. All right, thanks. All right, guys, welcome back to the Rockstar Flipper YouTube channel. And today was my bin haul for um, Tuesday uh, for the bin off against Nicole, Nicole State, State's Place. Um, she, I think, was unable to do her haul today, so she's going to do it tomorrow. Uh, there was inclement weather. They got ice and snow and all that stuff. So her uh, kids, or her son was off school. She had to watch her son. And um, so I think she's going to try to do it tomorrow. Whatever day she gets it done and gets it up, I'll link it. And then you guys can watch this video and then go link to hers and vice versa. And then um, we're going to do a live video uh, this week. It might be Thursday to kind of compare what we have. But leave down in the comment section below how you think I did. And then when you watch her video, you guys can comment about who you think did better, who you think is going to make more money, etc. All that good stuff. And then, of course, we're going to sell these items over the course of a few weeks. And then we'll do an update in a few weeks. We'll set a date, like maybe whatever, February, whatever it is, Valentine's Day, February 20th, whatever day it is. And we'll compare who did more sales only on these items. And we're going to stick to the honesty, the honest, uh, you know, honor system here. Um, cause we're gonna have to go back through our solds. You guys can go through our completed and solds, but, um, we're going to just total it up and see who sold and who made the most money. Now I only spent $23 today. So Nicole's got two more dollars worth of spending she can do. Um, I could have spent two more dollars towards this stuff, but I only spent 23. Um, and I'm just going to run through it off for you guys. I don't know how many items I got, so we'll count them. Uh, and I'm going to go quick cause it's a lot of items. This is a peaches uniform. 
Uh, this is an extra large, which is a good size, and it's cute. It's fire trucks and Dalmatians. I think that's awesome. I think some vet tech or some nurse or scrub, somebody that wants a scrub top is really going to like that. Um, I'm going to do an estimate of what I think I can sell this stuff for. I think this is a $12 sale. All right. Got this little boy's uh, Guy Harvey fishing button-up shirt. You guys know I love the Guy Harvey shirts. I think it's a $10 shirt, so that's $22. These are gross sales, of course. Got this awesome My Little Pony dress. I think it's $15. So that's $37. Nice rainbow dash. I love it. I got a bunch of ties. I'll just grab all the ties here. Hopefully I grab all of them. And, um, I mean, I'm just going to base the ties on selling them after fees and shipping at like a couple bucks. So... We got one, we got two, we got three, we got a Kenneth Cole is four, we're at 37 right now, so we got five, we got six, we got seven, We got this basketball one. I'll even count this as a couple bucks, even though I'll get more out of it. Eight. We got a Jay Garcia. It's definitely going to do more than a couple bucks. That's nine. Jay Garcia, great brand to keep an eye out for. And we got a Jimmy V, which will do more than a couple bucks. Jimmy V, a good one. That's ten. So we got ten ties at two bucks a piece. Is um, oh, we got another one. Is eleven. We'll just do we'll just do twenty bucks on the ties. So that's uh, fifty-seven dollars. Um, got these jeans. These are uh, 21 black by Rue 21. Nothing special, but I just thought they were super cute. And uh, and I think they'll be 15. So that's 72. Um, this top is by Jennifer Lopez. I think it's 12 bucks. So 82, 80, or 82, yeah, 84. couple pair of swimming trunks. These are um, going to be back in season pretty soon. These are O'Neal and they come with the cut here. So uh, I think these are 12. So that's 94, 96. And then I think these ones are 14. These are a little bit better of a brand. So this will put us uh, at 100 and what? 110, give or take? 105, 110? 110. These are... Um, Size 36, and if you guys can't tell the brand on these, let me show you, let me find it here. I was trying to find the tag. Ugh, please tell me the tag is still on this. The size tag's on it, which is important, and I know the brand. It's called Red Sand. Anyways, so we're at 110 there. Pair of $15 American Eagle size zero jeans. Christina saw me get these, so 125. Um, let's see what else we got. A little $8 minion shirt. Pretty fun. 133 This dress, which I know people gave me dirty looks getting, but you know what? I think it's awesome. I think it's 10 bucks. 143 And I'm just going low ball on this stuff, guys. A couple more ties. Just a couple bucks. So 145 MMA shirt that I think is $10. 155. This is a real, um, real legends fishing shirt. It's got the the lining in it, the sunproof lining. I think it's fifteen dollars, so that's 170. This is a big one too. It's the three X, so should sell pretty quick. Men's three X. Got this white. <sighs> White House Black Market jean jacket, which I think is cool. I think it's 15. Actually, I think this is probably 20. I think that's going to be 20. I think we're pretty close to 100 to $200 right now. We got a zombie shirt. 10 bucks. 210. Little Adidas zip-up jacket for a kid. 
220. Another tie. Got this awesome Jester's Halloween costume. I think it's $20 easy. It's cool. You guys can see that, I think. 240. Uh, this little sequin, I don't know the brand on this. I thought it was a cool shirt. I think it's worth 15, so it'd be 255. This is by Jane Norman. Never heard of it, but it was just a cool little top. 255. Um, this is another dress up costume that I got. This is like a, a winch type top. Maybe 10 on this. Put us at 265. The Espana, look for these guys. Anything with Spain, Espana on it, pretty good. 10 on that, 265. Got the Batman dress up costume for a little boy, $15. It's got the Batman symbol on it. 280. Um, got a PGA Tour licensed 2X golf shirt, 10 bucks easily. 295. Got another Halloween Horror Nights Walking Dead shirt. Sold the last one for 15. That's 310. Running out of items here, guys. We're getting down to the bottom. Another tie. It's got quite a few ties. I picked up the 70s shirt. It's a costume, but it's from the 70s. It's cool. I think somebody will pay 15 for this. Oh, what else do we get here? Got a little Tommy Hilfiger purse. Probably 15. Got a Miami Heat bikini top. Again, guys, the swimsuits are coming into style in this season right now. Probably 15 on that. Got a little dress. A little girl's glitter dress. Awesome. Probably 10 bucks. And then we got a Ninja Turtle costume. Full-size Ninja Turtle costume. It also came with the back piece. That's a turtle shell. Pretty cool. I'm going to try to get 15 to 20 out of this. Came with a little belt, too. So overall, I think probably in the mid to high 300s, maybe up to 400 gross sale. Um, net sale, probably around three. Hopefully, in the next 30 days, I can do three to $400 in sales on this. And hopefully, Nicole doesn't score any crazy, like, leather jackets or Tory Burch $150 items. If she doesn't, I'll be in good shape. Otherwise, she'll probably win. But we'll... We'll see. Maybe her sales on those items won't be so good. Maybe they will be. I don't wish for her to have bad sales. I just hope she sells everything else and not the stuff she gets at her bin. So, guys, that's the bin off. That's my merchandise. You guys can play this video back. If I ever claim to sell something that is not in this video that's a part of this, then it doesn't count. You guys have this video to reference. So I appreciate everyone watching. Christina, it's very nice to meet you. Um, also, I met another uh, gentleman today. I can't name him. I can't tell you about him. He is not on video because of his uh, full-time job uh, would not allow it. Uh, he would be in a lot of trouble. But um, he approached me today and thanked me for giving him an outlet to make extra money to keep his head above water when he lost his previous job of 13 years. He was laid off. Um, and I really appreciate it. I'm really uh, thankful that I could help him. Um, I'm, I, I'm happy to hear that he was able to resell and, and keep his income between his savings and his reselling income. He was able to pay his bills and, and keep his life um, and his kids and everybody taken care of. So it was really nice to hear. I wish you could have been on video, but you know who you are. And thank you so much uh, for saying hi and, uh, and introducing yourself. Um, and Christina, you were awesome. It was a lot of fun uh, shopping with you. And uh, I hopefully I win, even though the store was crazy today and it didn't have the best stuff. We did okay. We did all right. It wasn't a bad haul. Um, you probably did better than me. So um, with that, I'll leave you guys. As always, if you like the haul, you can press the like button down there. Um, guys, I heard a few people say that they had been unsubscribed to my channel. If that's the case, make sure you are subscribed every time you come on here. Check out that little subscribe button um, and make sure you are still subscribed. I really appreciate it. And you can email me or hit me up on social media down in the description box below. If you need any supplies, those links are below as well, directly to my Amazon affiliate account. I do get a couple dollars every time you buy something. If you need supplies, please use those links. I really appreciate that as well. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow, which is Wednesday. We may do a live show. We're going to do a live show for Thursday, obviously, normal time. Uh, maybe do a live show tomorrow night or maybe later tonight if I get home at a decent time. Um, with that, have a wonderful evening, and I'll see you guys next time.